So who is Booster Gold and why is he one of my favorite superheroes? Basically, I'll tell you who he is. He's a guy who's always out for himself. He was a football player from the future and he was an all-star and he had his past set, but he started gambling on his own games basically for other reasons. And he threw one game and then everybody caught him and he couldn't get a job. His scholarship was gone, everything was gone. After that, the only job he can get was as a security guard in a superhero museum. And from there he got the idea and he stole a power suit and a force field thing and a legion of a superhero's flight ring and a security robot and a time machine. And he came back in time to our time to become a superhero and he had all these records of you know oh there's gonna be a volcano going off here this bad guy's gonna rob this bank here so he knew where to be and he was in it for himself and there was a time where he was just like loaded up with corporate sponsorships and basically like you say he's, he's in it for himself um, and then there came a time where somebody went back and started messing with the timeline and they would like attack superman's grandfather as a baby and manipulate it so green lantern never became green lantern and nobody's going after booster gold so booster gold and rip hunter had to go through time to save everything but then in order to make sure nobody ever attacked booster gold in his past he had to go down in history as a joke and he kind of already was a bit of a joke but like i say he's got a big ego he ended up saving the entire time stream but he can't tell anyone about it because he has to go down in history as the joke so you know at one point like he saves a kid and this kid's like who are you and he's like i'm booster gold and the kid's like wow that's cool i'm gonna tell everybody Booster Gold saved me and he's like ah you know what just you know tell him Superman saved you and I think just because of that Booster Gold just his ego and he's always up to something and then he developed into this true hero that just can't take the credit and that's why he's one of my favorite heroes and then just always before that like he's just entertaining to read he's always been a true hero at heart when Doomsday showed up Booster Gold was on that Justice League which wasn't the best Justice League but like Booster Gold stepped between Superman and Doomsday like, he got in the way and you know he's from the future so he knew what Doomsday was going to do his relationship with Blue Beetle like Booster Gold and Blue Beetle together have always been very entertaining Blue Beetle on his own is a fun character just pairing up with Booster they work really well together it, they're just probably the best set of friends there is in comics. Booster Gold's always been a good time. The Justice League cartoon where he's in there trying to get the credit and he saves the whole world. That's a taste of who Booster Gold is. You should look up that Justice League episode. He was on an episode of Smallville where they kind of did him all right. He finally showed up in Legends of Tomorrow, uh, played by Donald Faison, and it was like, oh, it's exciting, but then that show got canceled. So uh, when James Gunn announced today that a Booster Gold series is coming from HBO, it just has me really excited. So I thought I'd make this quick video about Booster Gold because I'm excited about Booster Gold. Anyway, have a good night.